Hi there, Richard the Dick Coughlin 616. This is just going to be a quick video uh, informing you of something that happened uh, yesterday. Uh, follow up from my video. First thing I want to say is uh, I am going to be doing a more c uh, full follow up to my video um, because there are certain things that need to be addressed in my video, certain clarifications that need to uh, be made, and there are actually a couple of mistakes that I made that I need to address. And I will be doing that, so um, that will be coming eventually. But I want to share something with you out there to show you. See, Thunderfoot made a video here called The Subtle Art of Self-Delusion. I find this a very, I'm now finding this a more ironic title than uh, I would have, would have originally thought. You see, uh, yesterday, and I was informed this, I was informed of this um, by a user called Dixie Comic, who was in a, I'll put a link to his channel, who was in a blog TV being hosted by DPR Jones. Thunderfoot was uh, one of the co-hosts along with uh, Happy Cabby and uh, I don't know who else was in the room at the fucking time. Um, but yeah, that, that was basically, that's what was going on. And Thunderfoot brought up his videos, uh, the people who, people who are making videos of him, doing the same fucking stuff, going, well, people didn't criticize this, people didn't criticize that. First of all, Thunderfoot, there were people criticizing you when you did your Bible series, because it was fucking shit, okay? And there were people, like Superfly was another one, there were several other people who were doing it, and you ignored them. You ignored those fucking criticisms, and you carried on doing it, okay? Now that's just a fucking, that's just my person taking it. I thought it was crap too, but I'm not a biblical scholar, and because I don't feel like going into fucking realms that I don't know anything about, unlike you, I won't fucking bother, I, I won't bother, I wasn't going to do a criticism of them, because I'm not a biblical scholar, and I'm not highly fucking knowledgeable in that area, but then neither are fucking you, mate, but then you were the one making the videos, but then this is a fucking, let me explain something else to you, Thunderfoot, right? When you debunked creationists, you did so using scientific facts based on certain claims that were made by fucking uh, creationists and certain actual claims made uh, in the Bible that can be debunked with facts. This is not what you're doing. You are using facts to either spin them into your opinion or you're just putting forward your opinion or you're talking if polemic or, you know, just basically emotional, uh, emotionally inflammatory rhetoric. That's all you're doing, mate. And that's fucking fine. But when you're sharing opinions, when you're sharing opinions, the room for criticism is much greater. But here's the good pit. Here's the, me, this is where Thunderfoot shows his true fucking colours. Right, because my video, someone, I think DPR Jones uh, mentioned that my video was being played, I'd made a video about this, and so DPR Jones said, shall we play Coughlin's video and listen to, um, the, listen to the audio of it, and he said, okay, he starts playing my video, after one minute, one minute of my fucking video, Thunderfoot says, screw that noise, turn it off, all he's doing is calling me an arsehole. Now, whether you agree with me or not, right, whether you agree with me or not, now, first of all, in the first minute of that video, I did, I did no such thing as call Thunderfoot an arsehole at all, right, I don't like Thunderfoot, this is no fucking, there's no real fucking secret there, but in that video, I addressed his points, I responded to them, and I presented uh, evidence, and I was presented uh, facts and statistics, and I showed them in, in, put them in what I drew the conclusions that I fucking made for them. You don't have to agree with me on that, but don't even, but please, there is no fucking way you can sit there and say, all I did was call him an arsehole. And that's what Thunderfoot did. He said, screw that noise, turn it off, I'm not interested, all he's doing is calling me an arsehole. That is the subtle art of self-delusion, Thunderfoot. That is the kind of fucking person you are. There was other things that are in this blog TV uh, audio that I'm not going to fucking go into because they're not really relevant to me, right? But Thunderfoot, if all you want is to not be criticised, if you want someone who's just going to sit there and agree with you and say back to you how great you are and that everything you say is right, get a parrot, you dumb fuck. Now, you can take that one as an insult, arsehole. Richard the Dick Coughlin, 616. Good night, may God be less.